Good morning, students. How you are? I hope all are fine. So, in the previous class, you learnt parts of speech. Is it? So, before going to start this period, I want to ask some questions on previous topic. What you have learnt? What is parts of speech? Yes, when you speak. when you read when you write we use different type of words those are called parts of speech okay now matra bekadre bodh bekadre bari bekadre bere bere ya reetiya ondu padagalanna use martivi adakku na ven anta karitivi andre parts of speech anta karitivi total how many parts of speech are there yes parts of speech how many parts of speech are there Eight, of course. Eight parts of speech are there: noun, pronoun, adjective, verb, adverb, preposition, conjunction, then finally interjection. These are parts of speech. Eight parts of. So even all the things you learned very well in the previous class. So what is noun? Now, na name of anything, name of anything, a bird, a place, a person, a things, a vegetables, a fruits, a flowers, a whatever you take. So now, na dre, nama pada, yao dre yasir bo, bhakti, vastu, stala, annu, tarakari, ato na mo body parts, yao dre bo. Like na vienat karite ang dre, that is called noun. Even you learnt kinds of noun. Which are the kinds of noun you learnt? Proper noun, common noun, material noun, collective noun, abstract noun, countable and uncountable noun you learnt. Okay. What is that? Proper noun, particular person, place, or thing. That is called proper noun. For example, Ganga. Maesh, America, India. Those are particular name. So that means that is a proper noun. Common noun means boy, girl, father. Yes, those are common noun. Collective noun means group of people or person or thing. Crowd, library, bunch. Okay, bunch. Okay, swarm. Pride of lions. You see, all these are collective noun. So let's material noun means name of things. That is called material noun. Pen, paper, wood, stone. That is also material noun. Let's go to the abstract noun. Abstract noun means we can't touch, we can't see. Only we can feel. That is called abstract noun. For example, here. Knowledge, oxygen, gas, poverty, richness. Yes, these are abstract noun. Even countable and uncountable also you learnt. Countable means we can count the things that is called countable noun. For example, pen. Okay, marker, pencil. Yes, all these are countable noun. So that like, what is uncountable noun? We can't count the things. We can't count the things that is called an uncountable noun. For example, water, oil, sky, stars. Okay, milk. All these are what type of noun? Uncountable noun. Yes, even pronoun. What is pronoun? It is used instead of noun that is called pronoun. I, we, you, he, she, it, and they. These are called what? Pronouns. Then verb. Verb is what? Verb is an action word. Verb is an action word. Okay, regular and uh, irregular also you learned in the previous class. Okay. So then adverb means it describe a verb. Or another adverb, or another adjective that is called 
adverb for example most of adverbs i told you already most of adverbs end with ly happily quickly that like okay then preposition preposition means it is used before the noun or pronoun it is used before noun or pronoun or relation word it shows the relation between a word a sentence okay big okay and and sorry that is a conjunction from to in on above below under beside between all these are preposition word that like conjunction joining word because so ends till until however huh because but or neither nor either or not only but also all these are conjunction word then interjection interjection means what you learned kinds of learn kinds of sentence you learn na exclamation sentence did you learn yes what is the exclamation sentence here in the parts of speech we are calling that is interjection exclamation anta now ಸೆಂಟೆನ್ಸ್ ನಾವು ಕರೆದ್ರೆ ಇಲ್ಲಿ ಪಾರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಸ್ಪೀಚ್ ನಾವು ಅದೇ ಒಂದು ಅದನ್ನು ನಾವೇನು ಕರಿತೀವಿ ಅಂತಾರೆ ವಟ್ ಯು ಕಾಲ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಇಂಟರ್ಜೆಕ್ಷನ್ ಓಕೆ ದಿಸ್ ಮಚ್ ಯು ಲರ್ನ್ ಇನ್ ದಿ ಪ್ರೀವಿಯಸ್ ಕ್ಲಾಸ್ ಸೊ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ಈಸ್ ದೇರ್ ವಾಟ್ ಈಸ್ ದಿ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಚಾಪ್ಟರ್ ಈಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಗ್ರಾಮರ್ ಬುಕ್ ಇಫ್ ಯು ಯುವರ್ ಗ್ರಾಮರ್ ಬುಕ್ ಜಸ್ಟ್ ಲುಕ್ ದಟ್ ಫಸ್ಟ್ ಲೆಸನ್ ಈಸ್ ದೇರ್ ಕೌಂಟೇಬಲ್ಸ್ ಆ್ಯಂಡ್ ಅನ್ಕೌಂಟೇಬಲ್ ಅನ್ಕೌಂಟೇಬಲ್ let's see what is the difference already you learned although once again we are going to learn so kinds of sorry countable what is countable or what is uncountable let's see through the example okay, with the definition see here first thing things things we can count things we can count or call or call countable nouns what is the definition is there things we can count when you count the things when possible to count the things that is called countable noun okay that is called what type of noun countable noun when you calculate when you count the things then only you say that that is a countable noun the sometimes the word countable underline whatever okay things we can count it means we can count the things are called a countable noun andre enslike bartakanta ಇದ್ರೆ ಎನ್ಸ್ಲಿಕೆ ಬರ್ತಿದ್ರೆ ಅದಕ್ಕೆ ನಾವು ಏನಾದ್ರು ಕರಿಬೇಕಂತ ಹೇಳಿದ್ದಾನ ಕೌಂಟೇಬಲ್ ನೌನ್ ಅಂತ ಹೇಳ್ಬೇಕು ಅಂತ ಹೇಳಿದ್ದಾನೆ ಓಕೆ ಫಾರ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಈಗ ಮಾರ್ಕರ್ ಐತೆ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಯು ಕೌಂಟ್ ಒನ್ ಮಾರ್ಕರ್ ಟೂ ಮಾರ್ಕರ್ಸ್ ತ್ರೀ ಮಾರ್ಕರ್ಸ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಯು ಕೌಂಟ್ ಇಟ್ ಕ್ಯಾನ್ ಕೌಂಟ್ ಮಾಡಕ್ ಬರ್ತಾ ತಾನೆ ಇದು ಸೊ ಇಟ್ ಈಸ್ ವಾಟ್ ಟೈಪ್ ಆಫ್ ನೌನ್ ಕೌಂಟೇಬಲ್ ನೌನ್ ಫಾರ್ ಎಕ್ಸಾಂಪಲ್ ಮಾರ್ಕರ್ ಎಸ್ ಪೆನ್ one pen i have if i have more than one two pens are there three pens are there is it countable noun is it ensley ke bartane so pen okay mobile mobile countable noun what mobile two mobiles three mobiles is it right book book answer bartane one book books two books three books 
for example pencil can you count it pencil count mark bartalla one pencil two pencils three pencils that like pencil okay door door and sir bartha hai one door two doors three doors can you calculate chair okay chair table okay then yes all those are what type of noun all those are countable noun because we can count 1 2 3 4 5 this like we can count so that is called countable noun ಅರ್ಥಾಯ್ತಲ್ಲ ಎನಿಸ್ಲಿಕ್ಕೆ ಬಂದಾದ್ರೆ ಅದಕ್ಕೆ ನಾವು ಏನಂತ ಕರಿಬೇಕಂದ್ರೆ ಕೌಂಟೇಬಲ್ ನೌನ್ ಅಂತ ಕರಿಬೇಕು ಅಂದ್ರೆ ನೀವು ಪ್ರೀವಿಯಸ್ ಕ್ಲಾಸ್ ನೋಡಿ ಆಲ್ರೆಡಿ ಇಲ್ಲ ಅಂಟ್ ಓಕೆ ಇಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಓಕೆ ಶಾಲೆ ಕಂಟಿನ್ಯೂ ಓಕೆ ಲೆಟ್ ಸಿ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ವಿ ಕಾಂಟ್ ಆರ್ ಕಾಂಟ್ ಆರ್ ಕೆನಾಟ್ ಥಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ವಿ ಕಾಂಟ್ count are called uncountable now look that what is uncountable uncountable it means what we can't count we can't count that when you count when you count a count the letter that is called uncountable noun any slip of barangla andre that means what that is a uncountable noun for example in the bottle ink is there can you separate it 1 2 3 4 5 that like you know separate martre 1 2 2 3 angachara separate makagutha is it possible to separate it highly impossible so ink for example ink okay ink santa karithira nu ink ink santa karithira correct agala so water water santa karithira neeru galu anta karithira neeru is it what type of noun what type of noun it is it is also uncountable noun then oil butter milk sky soil then star so let's see stars nakshatra nakshatra is it possible one two three four is it possible to count all the stars highly impossible ensakagutha na one two three four anta ensakagutha ಮಣ್ಣು ಮಣ್ಣು ನೆನೆಸ್ತಾರೆ ಮಣ್ಣುಗಳು ಅಂತೀರಾ ಡಸ್ಟ್ ಧೂಳು ಅದು ಕೂಡ ಅನ್ಕೌಂಟೇಬಲ್ ಧೂಳು ಐತೆ ಅಂತ ಕರೀತಾರೆ ಅದಕ್ಕೆ ನೆನೆಸಕ್ಕಾಗತ್ತೆ ದಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಪಾಸಿಬಲ್ ಟು ಕೌಂಟ್ ನೌ ಐ ಲಿ ಇಂಪಾಸಿಬಲ್ ಸೊ ಈ ವಾಟರ್ ಆಯಿಲ್ ಬಟರ್ ಮಿಲ್ಕ್ ಸ್ಕೈ ಸಾಯಿಲ್ ಸ್ಟಾರ್ ಆಲ್ ದೀಸ್ ಆರ್ ವಾಟ್ ಟೈಪ್ ಆಫ್ ನೌನ್ ಹಾಂ ಆಲ್ ದೀಸ್ ಆರ್ what type of noun all these are uncountable noun all these are what type of noun all these are uncountable noun because we can't count these are we can't count for example sugar one more example rice enna sir one rice two rice three rice ant enna sir enna sakaltane okay enisalike bant andre ಎನಿಸ್ಲಿಕ್ಕೆ ಬಂದವ್ರು ಯಾವ ನೋನ್ ಅದು ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ಕೌಂಟೇಬಲ್ ನೋನ್ ಎನಿಸ್ಲಿಕ್ಕೆ ಬರುದಿಲ್ಲ ಇಫ್ ದಟ್ ಈಸ್ ನಾಟ್ ಪಾಸಿಬಲ್ ಟು ಕೌಂಟ್ ದಟ್ ಮೀನ್ಸ್ ಅನ್ಕೌಂಟೇಬಲ್ ನೌನ್ ಅಂದ್ರೆ ಅರ್ಥ ಏನದ ಅನ್ಕೌಂಟೇಬಲ್ ಆಗಿರುತ್ತೆ ಏನಾಗಿರ್ತದ ಅನ್ಕೌಂಟೇಬಲ್ ನೌನ್ ಆಗಿರುತ್ತೆ ಇಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ ಅರ್ಥ ಆಯ್ತಲ್ಲ ಓಕೆ so look at some uncountable nouns what type of uncountable nouns are there uncountable 
Countables, no more problem. Let us see uncountables. Uncountables, what type of uncountables nouns are there? What type of uncountables uh, nouns are there? Let's see one by one. Name of thing. Name of substance. Other. Substance means things. Substance means water. In the bracket, you have to write things. And what's the word? What's the word? Name of things. Uncountable noun. What type of uncountable nouns are here? Let's see here. Bread. 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 It is also thing. It is an uncountable thing. Bread. Okay. Beer. Okay. Cloth. Coffee. Coffee. Hmm? Ice. Oil. Grass. Hmm? Tea. Tea. Wood. Wood. Okay. Paper. A soap. Sand. Soap. Just look those examples. All those examples we can't count. All these are things. These are things like bread are the one thing. Beer are the one thing. Okay, then coffee, ice, and ice cream or oil. Grass, tea, wood, sand, soap, cream. You will line up properly. These are things. These are uncountable nouns. These are what type of nouns? These are uncountable things. Okay. Let's see second one. What is that? Name of qualities. Name of qualities or actions. Name of qualities or actions. Qualities are the guna. Qualities are the guna guru. Actions are the create. Okay. Qualities are guna. For example, beauty. Okay. Health. Honesty. S is honesty. Okay. Death, birth, death, birth, okay, knowledge, knowledge, okay, mercy, mercy, okay, then courage. Qualities or actions. What are the qualities are there? Beauty, honesty, okay, then knowledge, mercy, courage, all these are qualities. Okay, see, work, see, work, work, sleep, okay, just those are actions. Those are actions. Is it right? Is the name of qualities or actions? Arthatala. Name of qualities or actions. Beauty, help. Help it is also action. Honesty, death, birth, knowledge. All those are what qualities. Yes, these are also what type of noun? These are also uncountable noun. These are what type of noun? Uncountable noun. Let's see next. One more thing you have to learn. You have to see. Special. Some special words. Look there. What are these special words? Some special words. So many words are there. You have to check. Check that in your home. Damage. Ok. 
ओके देन फर्नीचर फर्नीचर रबिश न्यूज पार्किंग पार्किंग ओके वेदर 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 लगेज हेयर लगेज Yes, look that. All these are what type of noun? These are also uncountable noun, but special. These are what type? Special nouns. Furniture damage. Yes, she damaged her life. Okay. Okay, damaged her life. Damage. Okay, how are you? Furniture. I pick up a corner. Rubbish. अरे वाले सो न्यूज़ अरे सुधी पार्किंग अरे पार्क मरो सो है ये दर आओ माना तो वाता वाना आओ माना तो कर ये दर ये ये अंदर कूद ला सो देन लगेज लगेज अंदर हाँ ये तो उन डायरेक्टर लगा दर डेटिंग कर लगेज ये बेला ये ना कुछ तो पंद्रे आउ दिस आर स्पेशल वर्ड्स जस्ट कीप दैट पॉइंट इन योर म Keep this point in your mind. All these are what type of word? Special words in uncountable noun. Special nouns. Uncountable only. These are special nouns. These are special nouns. Is it understand? Arta thala. Damage. Furniture. Rubbish. News. Parking. Weather. Hay. Luggage. So all these are, hmm. what type of noun? All these are uncountable noun. Okay. Okay. Homework. Just write uncountable and countable examples. Write. Countable and uncountable examples you have to write. अर्थात् इतना you have to write countable and uncountable nouns. It is your homework. Okay. See you in the next class.